is a freestyle fighter, standing five foot eight, weighed in 156 pounds. He holds a professional record, six wins, one defeat with two wins, coming by way of knockout, three by way of submission. Representing the training lab and fighting out of Del Mar, California, Spike, the Alpha Ginger Carla. Your referee Let's in charge go. of the action, Mike Beltran. All right, jump in over the rules already. Protect yourself at all times. Obey my commands all the time. Stuff comes now. Come on out. Have your business. Let's go. There is the oh, Alpha is. Ginger, Spike Carlisle. Yeah. You can probably figure out why he's called the Alpha Ginger, Pat, right? I tell you what, he looks like he's uh, fairly intense. Absolutely, and so is his opponent, Matthew Cahoon, the Gold Lion. We are scheduled for three five-minute rounds in the LFA, a right, lightweight gentlemen. division. First round. You ready to fight? You ready to fight? Hell, let's go! Big Mike Beltran gets us underway, and the uh, Alpha Ginger comes out firing. Well, he's doing what he said he was going to do. Go for takedowns right away. He's got that extensive judo, jiu-jitsu background and also wrestled for several years. So going to his strengths. Cahoon able to fight off the initial takedown so far. But Carlisle, as Pat mentioned, brown belt and BJJ, black belt and judo, national judo champion and two-time national BJJ champion. On the other side, Matthew Cahoon, a what a crazy story. Pat, he's, this is his first fight at 155. Three months ago, he weighed 205 pounds. Yeah, that's a little bit of weight. That's I, I want to get his diet from him. <laughs> Probably works. Apparently. Vegan, right? Yep, Go, went vegan, and a lot of athletes are doing that. Nice job rolling through on that takedown. What's that knee? And a transitional knee. I don't think he needed to watch the knee, as the ref said, in my mind, because I think they were both coming up. Yeah. Mike Beltran always spot on, though. Cahoon fights his way back up, but it's not going to last long. Carlisle plants him on the mat. Cahoon been very active. Second fight in 20 days. Third fight in three weeks. Cahoon comes in with a six and three record. Carlisle six and one. Nice job getting back up each time, though. Watch the cage. Get your fingers off the cage. Mike Beltran doesn't play Get your around. Fingers out of the cage. Knock that Warning off. Cahoon about fingers in the cage. Cahoon packs some power in those punches. Five knockouts out of his six victories. Carlisle looks like he should be in a Mel Gibson movie with a kilt on. <laughs> I like it. I'm serious, man. Look at him. He looks rough. 26-year-old from Del Mar, California. Both of these fighters making their LFA debuts tonight. Calhoun switching up stance. He just needs to use his jab. Just start controlling the fight with his jab. Absolutely. That's what he told us he was going to do. Nice knee to the body from Cahoon. Look at him stepping out of that. Nice. Six and a half inch reach advantage for Matthew Cahoon. On the hook. Hold the hands locked. Use that length. Ah, look at him slide the hands up. Nice job. Oh, look at him going to the arm bar. Missed it. Wow. While able to escape from it now on the guard of Cahoon. Entertaining action. Let's see what Spike Carlisle can do from this spot. Back to the fence. Back to the fence. Back to the fence. Good job right there. There we go. There we go. Work on the backing up. He got nothing for you. He just want to lay and pray. There we go. There we go. There we go. Back up. And his back taken, but he in control here. Use the fence. Why him off your back? Opportunity for Spike Carlisle. And here's corner saying, don't get too high, Spike. Good job, good job. There we go, Matt. There we go. Nice sprawl that time. Good reaction. Oh, nice job. Oh! 
Oh, 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 oh my goodness. The, the Alpha Ginger, Ginger Spike Carlisle ends this fight in an instant. Welcome to the LFA Spike Carlisle. I tell you what, Calhoun thought he had him dead to rights. The back was turned to him. He was loading up with that left hand to throw it. And just wasn't thinking defense at all at that point. Listen to this. Right on the chops. Boom. Great shot from our Access TV Fights crew there. As Spike Carlisle, this fight in the first round in dramatic fashion. Great example of why there aren't very many undefeated fighters in this sport. <laughs> well put. Carlisle made his pro debut in September of 2017. Woo! Won his first four fights all in round number one. And he will add a highlight reel knockout to his resume. Carlisle training, training lab with some of the best, including the Filipino wrecking machine, Mark Munoz. Trained with TJ Dillashaw and Cub Swanson as well. But what a debut for Spike Carlisle. Let's now get the official time from Mike Kendall. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee Mike Beltran calls a stop to the fight. Three minutes, 58 seconds into the very first round, declaring your winner by knockout, Spike the Alpha Ginger Carla. Successful LFA debut for Spike Carlisle improves to an impressive 7-1. Looks to shake things up in the LFA 155-pound division. Well, tomorrow night, some Access TV Fights alumni will travel to China to display their skills in the UFC octagon, including former LFA and legacy welterweight champion Derek Trance, who is looking for his first victory in the UFC. And Tiago Moises, the former RFA title holder, throws down with Demir Ismogulov. Also another past LFA title holder, Anthony Hernandez, the former LFA middleweight champ, makes his second appearance in the UFC. Best of luck to all the Access TV Fights alumni in China. More LFA 74 action coming up after this.